everybody. It's your favorite fucking savage, Jens the Beast. So we're on the fucking road. We're um, heading to my um, therapist, Reggie. Going to get some deep tissue massage and uh, then we're going to train some chest and arms. It's actually been a while since uh, I did a video in English, so excuse my fucking language. So yeah, I got a topic for you guys. Something I've been um, seeing a lot of as an online coach, helping people out over the last six years. And um, there's this kind of tendency that people think that um, making a healthy choice for themselves is the hard choice, is the hard way. It's, they find it difficult to, um, to do some, something good for themselves, to take care of their body, like uh, quit smoking and uh, maybe uh, quit drinking fucking two gallons of coke a day, eating McDonald's all the time, stuff in the face with chocolate and shit like that. A lot of these people that um, that I run into have these situations, these problems. It's people that have health issues like diabetes or um, other health health uh, issues, having hard time playing with the kids, can't be physically uh, physically active, all in all just have a shitty situation with the body and every day is fucked up no energy from the start when they get out of bed no fucking energy at all for me it's like it's fucking mind-blowing how the fuck can you tell yourself that it's a it's a hard choice to take care of yourself how how the fuck can you tell yourself that it's the the hard choice to do something good for yourself to take care of your body you only have one life you only have one body you're going to live in this body till you die you want to make the best of everything and why do you, why do you choose to see the the easy way is to put shit in your body that you don't need like eat so much fucking shit that your body st uh, stops working functioning the easy choice should always be to do, take care of yourself and yeah i know it's fucking hard to get into dieting and it's uh it's a jungle out there but you need like seriously if you cut back on uh, drinking all the soda and eating all the candy and shit like that, junk food and smoking cigarettes and everything like that, all your fucking bad habits. If you quit all your bad habits, you could get the best online coach in the world for peanuts compared to your your budget, uh, your financial budget on, on what you're using on junk. Like, think about it logically. How much money are you spending every month on shit and how much money have you spent your whole life getting where you're at? So how about taking something back for yourself, putting some money into a, a dietitian or a nutritionist or an online coach that could help you out cleaning up your diet and getting your body back to where it's healthy and where you can start playing with the kids again. I, in my mind, I can't understand it. I, seriously, maybe just start, uh, start with, uh, with the simple things like quitting your bad habits and stuff like that. If you do that, you'll get a long fucking way and you'll see your financial situation will be much better and then you can actually go do something about it uh, with professional help and get everything cleaned up. And you know what? I'm working as a coach 24-7 and the clients that I have, they don't work with me more than six to eight months. Then they're off. Like, it's not a lifetime commitment. You learn as you go and in a professional relationship with a coach, you get all the tools that you need to carry on for yourself. So seriously guys, fucking take care of yourself and do something about it because there's so much obesity and so many health risks out there like fuck man it's yeah it's 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 just blowing my brains out man so do something about it guys take care of your body Reggie
guys, you know, you use so many fucking hours in the gym. You spend so much money on supplements, food and everything like that. Do yourself a fucking favor. If you're serious about training or anything like that, adjust in general. Do yourself a favor, put some money into a good therapist. It's fucking beneficial for you. It will help you out a great deal on every aspect. Also, if you're not a lifter. So do it for yourself. Find a good therapist and use the money wisely. And don't forget how much you use the other way around. So use your fucking brain. Yep.